So, hi, it's uh, Dale and Michael from Spotted Motors, and today we're joined by 10 year old petal head Dylan, and he has his first Chevy. I mean, what a car to start off, to with. Start off with at 10 year old Dylan. I mean, uh, having a Chevy at any age is impressive, but at 10 year old it's mega impressive. So, why don't you tell us a little bit about your Chevy? Right, it's an 800cc, it makes 52 horsepower. And it can do not to 60 in 16.2 seconds. Very, very impressive. So, how did you get your hands on this then? Dale and Michael gave me it. Oh, Michael, there we go, there we go. So basically, me and Michael got this car, uh, we were going to get it put back on the road with an MOT. Yeah. And then, Unfortunately, uh, uh, it was a bit too much work for us, wasn't it? Yeah, so and then that's where Dylan got involved, and uh, he, is now, he? he is now I've the proud owner of this Chevy. So I put filler in the bonnet yesterday. Yeah, so it had um, a bit of a dent there, didn't it? Yeah, a big one. And it never should, did it, Dylan? So I'll fix that as well. Yeah, so I, I spread, I had to take the mechanism out. Oh, right. um, so I've put filler in that. Yeah. I had to sand it down, take the badge off, put filler in it. Um, I need to prime it. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I need to spray it. Like, black stuff on it then you sand it off and it shows all, all the dots like ah, the right, low yeah. spots yeah. so then you've got to fill all those black spots then spray a primer on it then I'm going to take it off and spray it in my dad's spray booth absolutely wow, awesome fantastic and what else are you going to do with Dylan What's yeah come on we want to know I'm going to try and get this to fit properly yeah because it's bulged and dented in there yeah yeah I'm going to get a new back door I think right oh it's got a little dent there in the back yeah, door as well there. yeah yeah I think that's um, beyond repair that one isn't it yeah Nothing else. And inside, is there much to do inside? A good clean. A good clean. Was it a bit mouldy? Yeah. Go on, show, show everyone up close. Look at, the look at the clocks in the centre there. So it's, it's got, got a little rev counter. little rev counter in there. Yeah, um, fuel gauge and speedo. Yeah. It's on 50, it's on 59,000 miles. Right. Um, it's a low, low mileage car, it's isn't quite it? a low mileage yeah, car, really, isn't it? I was looking for something to buy, actually. Yeah, because you, um, you, you got rid of your Audi, what was it, an Audi? Uh, 100. Oh, Audi 100, yeah, that's right. I had yeah. an Audi 100, 2 litre. Yeah. Um, but I'm making 99 horsepower. Yeah. <laughs> but um, I sold that. Yeah, and have you seen the car since you recently sold it? Yeah, it's local. Do you like it? Yes. Yeah, it's it's no, nah, not really. No. Have you seen it? I've seen it. You've I seen actually it. like Lord, it. Lord, with those alloys. He's yeah. Put, yeah, he's put a nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Would you put alloys on this, or are you going to put some uh, wheel trims on it? Oh, David, this morning you bought some wheel trims. Oh, brilliant! It's quite amazing this car. Yeah. It's a small city car. It can seat five. It's got five seat belts, and it's got quite a lot of room in the well, back. What's that exhaust in the back there? That's for my next car. Is it not for this? No. Oh, okay. We thought I might need for this. You are right with me putting that on the, my Rover 75 I'm getting? <laughs> yeah, definitely, yeah. <laughs> I, know I'm, I know I might sell it to you, so I was wondering if you didn't, if you minded that. You don't have to sell a Rover 75 to do. No, I'd, I'd buy a Rover 75 every day of the week if I could. Uh, I'll take this now. So has it got wind down windows all round? Yeah. Um, this is the door car to go on there. Yeah. Goes the other way around. Yeah. Oh, it's been taken off, I don't know why. Maybe to get that dent out. Yeah, yeah. maybe push that dent out a little bit. Or make it look a little bit better. I don't know, everything's moved around though, so that door's kind of out of action. Um, so what's your, what's your plans after you do all this all these little bits of bolts to it? Hopefully, I'm going to get it back look brand new. Yeah. Which is going to be quite a big job. Yeah. Um, and then I'm going to hopefully sell it and make some money on it. Absolutely That's brilliant. Fantastic. That's what it's yeah. all about, isn't yeah. it? So you're 10 year old, you're on your, your very own Chevy. Yep. And do you know what would be even more impressive if, if you could drive it? But obviously you're only 10 and you can't drive, can you? Well, I can drive, but not legally. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, I'll demonstrate that. So what we do want to say is that obviously uh, Dylan is 10 year old, this is not the full UK license. No, we are on private land. We are on private land and his mum and dad are uh, right beside us. Uh, we're not crazy. <laughs> not crazy. And, and Dylan, the landlord Dylan is, doesn't mind. Yeah. Dylan yeah. is sensible. <laughs> so what we're going to do is Dylan's going to demonstrate his absolutely amazing driving skills at 10 year old with his very own Chevy. Uh, we've we've had a good chat about this and... Uh, oh, and I'm just saying everyone, I did not put these dents in. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> they were, they were pre-dents, weren't they? Yeah. Oh, and it's a 2008 model. Yeah. It's a base model. So and, what, and what else 
What did these cars originate as? Was it a deal with it? Yeah. And then Chevrolet took them over? No, they were badged. They were, oh. Oh, this right. is a Daewoo. This, this is, is a Daewoo Matiz, but it's badged as a Chevy. Right. And they also did a few Pontiacs, I think. Really? Oh, right. Yeah. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. They badged a few Pontiacs. Right. The, the older model, though, I think. Right. Um, and just for the record, this is his dad's car. <laughs> Another Chevy. <laughs> Two very different <laughs> Very, very different cars. And there's, if we're going to go through the family cars, I mean, look at this. There's uh, Dylan's mum's car as well. Beautiful. So this is 10 year old Dylan. A massive pet. This is 10 year old Dylan having the absolute time of his life in his Chevy. Handbrake turns, wheel spin the hell out of this thing. Look at that! And isn't this what being a petalhead's all about? It doesn't matter what you drive, what you own, it's getting involved, getting out there, having fun. Because this lad, in the next 10 years, God knows what he's going to have. This is what being a petal head is all about. Hats off, Dylan. I've got a smile on my face watching this. And a damn sight show that everyone watching this has as well. Oh dear, I'm not <laughs> confident here. Dylan, your driving skills are unbelievable. Ready? Oh, well, we're ready. Oh, why'd I do that? Slow start, but we're there now. Oh, this is rubbish. It was so much faster in the drive. Oh, that's fast enough for me. Fast enough there. Oh, hang on. <laughs> More fish. I'm gonna put the handbrake on in that puddle and you're gonna get out and you're gonna film it. I don't think so. Oh, no, like stand back. I'll do I'll do it forwards and backwards because uh, my mum's got a few videos of this but it wasn't quite this. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with you, Michael? <laughs> We've sent Michael up on the grass there, haven't we? Yeah, um, he's, he wants a fast handbrake turn and I'm going to do a burnout in first gear. Yeah. And our second, um, and reverse. The driving skills are unbelievable. Stop saying that. They are. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think I could do a handbrake turn at 10 year old. Right, fast handbrake turn first. Should we just leave Michael there when we're finished? That's not a bad idea, you always do that to me and I have to walk back. <laughs> what leaves you there? Yeah, he just leaves me and then I have to walk back to wherever we've sat. Well, I know. From. I'll pick him up, I'll lock the car and then I'll just drive off. <laughs> right, fastest handbrake turn. Not too much though, don't yeah. worry, I'm not going to overdo it. I'm not going to overdo it. Nice. Oh, oh perfection. Oh. That was awesome. That was all the way around that. Absolutely bonkers going on. Uh, we're going to head back down. We're going to say to our Dylan, thank you very much for having us. You've been an absolute stunt driver. Michael's getting an absolutely soggy wet. <laughs> so there you go. Never has a Chevy Matiz been uh, <laughs> driven so recklessly. <laughs> Dylan, thank you so much for putting a massive smile on my and Michael's face. We absolutely loved it. We can't see. Can't wait to see what you're going to do with it. Can't wait to see what you're going to buy next. And uh, you're an absolute massive pepper lead. We absolutely love it. Uh, thanks Dylan. Bye. You've been Spotted Motors. <laughs>